Captain Insano. Banana man, banana man, banana man. Oh. <laughs> what? GoPro almost slipped out of my hand. <laughs> he ran into the water. What y'all do, y'all? Uh, y'all getting lost? We got her on a big snapper bite. Mangroves? Yeah. So no. What'd you drop? My GoPro. Oh. Hang on. We got a GoPro in the water. It's gone. <laughs> no hanging on. Never mind. It's at the bottom of the water. Katie just dropped my scissors at the same time. Who's diving down to get them? Well, folks, the cost of filming an outdoor show in windy conditions, trying to get all these different shots for you guys. I, when I grabbed it off the power pole, it almost slipped out of my hands. Here I am filming Rich thinking he's got a decent fish at some little grunt. I turn around to go put it back on the power pole, put it on the power pole. I didn't get it on there all the way popped right off and went right into the drink. It's all Rich's fault. Jiggy! Jiggity! <laughs> Come on, man. <laughs> Coming out of your face, Jiggity. For, for a grunt, that a, Jiggity. That was for a, nice a grunt, grunt Jiggy. Though. It was not a nice grunt. Nice grunt. That grunt was tiny. Come on, man. Come on. Thinking in that one you wanted to keep? No, it was not. I saw it. <laughs> but I will give Jiggy some some props because he did put a nice keeper hog in the boat so now i'm i'm not limited to one camera i've got my iphone 12 pro i've got uh sony a6000 so i have other things that i can film on but it's just the easiest way to do it is with these gopros so now it's just going to be me for the rest of the show try screwing our screw trying to film these other guys <laughs> Rich, she's got another grunt. Got good... Jiggy! Hold on to that camera. Get, get Jiggy with it. <laughs> no! Scrap. Booyah. Man, y'all suck. <laughs> Look at that fat. Look at that fat fish. Look at how fat he is. What was that, man or man? We would have a limit if the other two people on the boat would catch fish. Me being one of them. Way yet, way yet, way yet, way yet. Now there you go, there you go. Poor man or man struggles every time we go out together. I think at this point, it's just, a mute thing that he just comes along for the <laughs> I'm just out here getting a suntan. <laughs> but I got a long sleeve shirt on, that ain't working either. I think you need to cut the beard, the goatee. I, I did that once. And man, did I get a ration of crap from my wife. Did you really? Because I got I went to work. Because you like, got really ugly? Is that No, I went to work and they're like, <laughs> uh Brian, that's getting a little long and I'm like, you gotta call Sabrina because I ain't cutting it. That's okay. As soon as you put your line in the water, you're going to catch a fish. Yeah, let's, I, I need to get back to fishing because because I, I can't do this. These guys aren't going to get it done. One thing that I've noticed when we're out fishing offshore, if we start catching strawberry grouper like this, then we're near some hogs. And sure enough, today if one of the spots we started catching strawberries. I said, "Ooh, we're in some hogs." And sure enough, Rich caught his keeper, and then he caught another keeper, and then he caught a shorter one. Oh! That was a good snapper, man. Ah! What'd you just yeah. catch, Rich? First hogfish. Woo! That's a good one, buddy. Yeah. Sweet. On the candy apple. Sweet. You take the jig. I don't know. Great. Rich. The other Jiggy Rich got one. Ooh, that that's bouncing like a hog. Yeah. Yep, another hogfish. Two in a row. Ooh, look at that box. 
Well, this man's just in fuego. <laughs> this is, he's never caught a hog fish, and this is his what, third one or third, fourth one? Third, third, I think. third one. Yeah. He's going to be close. Uh oh. Uh oh. Does Nan Nannerman have one? Nannerman's got something. Oh. Heads up! I'm fishing the boat. He could be close. Nice. <laughs> nice. 15. No, he's not a main. Well folks, I don't know how much I got on film because I dropped I dropped one GoPro in the water. It's Brian's fault. Nanner man. And Jiggy. Jiggy did good today though. How many hog fish did you catch? Got three, right? No, four. 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 Two, two, two in the box and two had to go back. Two had to go back. You redeemed yourself, Jiggy. Always I'm next proud time. of you. There's <laughs> always next time. Now, Nanderman, on the other hand, <laughs> I have not redeemed anything. <laughs> this poor guy. <laughs> uh, power pole. Would you please get some of the components in for the power pole charge for this gentleman right here? He's wanting to buy one, and uh, it's it is such a difference maker. I mean, it's been pretty rough out here, white capping. We're about at the end of the day though because i gotta get back in and go to some luau thing yay you got a grass skirt i get no i got a hawaiian shirt but i don't have a grass skirt i'd wear one if i had one Moms, here we go Near to me! Oh my god! Throw it in the water! Oh, oh you did not. Oh. That is all on camera. <laughs> okay, it's one thing to throw a GoPro in the can in the water, but come on, man. <laughs> like I said, I'm here for your entertainment. Holy lord! I don't know what to do. I, I just don't know what to do with him. I don't even know why I'm invited. <laughs> it's kind of hard not to invite you when it's your boat. <laughs> uh oh. Uh oh. That's a, good one. That's a good one. That could be another hog. Yeah. Get the loser out of the. Yeah. yeah. Get out of the way, you pansy. <sighs> hey, Rich, are you addicted to, to uh, oh, man. hogfish now? Oh, yeah. Have you you've had one? You've eaten one, right? No, I never. Oh had. my God! You haven't eaten one? No. Oh, There's a red grouper. And they're out of season. Yeah, he's not even close to being keeper anyway. If he was, man, I thought he had another hog. Oh. But this gen this gentleman here will have hogfish for the first time. He will die when he sees how white their meat is. It's incredible. Now I, I have mentioned before that the uh, that when we get typically get into strawberry groupers when we catch our hogfish. We haven't caught any strawberries in this not on this spot. Side. No, we've caught grunts and all that. So you got to go through a lot of grunts to get that hogfish. But what's happened is that since our trolling motor batteries are starting to weaken up, what's happening is we're we're slipping ever so slightly. With the trolling motor so we're actually kind of slow i mean slow slow drifting these this hard bottom that we're fishing so it actually gives us a little bit of an advantage because a lot of times these hogfish are not right on the ledges and not right on the hard bottom they're actually they like oh nader man's got another one let's see if he can keep it on they like to be kind of off into the sand edges because they like to root in the sand 
hence the name hogfish we've actually got some good action on this side of the boat hey. that side of the boat sucks right jiggy yes i got another grunt no it's not yes it is yes it is <laughs> see this rich over here he's quiet he's just getting the job done <laughs> <laughs> How much did that co combo cost you? <laughs> Is it as much as a GoPro? Yeah, it's three yeah. or 350. Yeah. yeah, that's what I thought. Hi, uh, my name's Nannerman, and I like to throw rods into the water. <laughs> uh, just see me on a golf course. <laughs> We should all go golf. Rich likes to golf too. Can do you see Jiggy Man golfing? He's gonna be out there in his bare feet. <laughs> Look at that. the guy doesn't even. Uh oh, trolling motor just gave out. The guy doesn't even say a word. <laughs> too busy grunting. <laughs> oh God. Grunt. Grunt. All that grunting for a grunt. Oh, grunt. No, we're not even holding. Well, that looks like it's going to conclude our day, but hey, what a, what a flurry of fish at the very end. As long as we beat the other boat. I don't think we I did. don't think we did. But we did good. We still have a really good yeah. cooler full of fish. I mean, Chad won't to... let us live it down, but... Chad ain't got nothing to say. <laughs> well, we should all go golfing. That would be fun to film. <laughs> Four! <laughs> I haven't golfed in years. I'd probably hurt something. Matter of fact, I know I would hurt something. You might pull something. <laughs> I had I re I got out of the truck the other day to run and go help this lady because there was a big alligator snapping turtle in the right in the right in the driveway of the Home Depot on the back side of it. So I, I get out of the truck and I run around and I get about three quarters of the way there and I pull my muscle up in my groin. <laughs> I'm walking around going, "Oh my god!" I didn't even run hard. Stumbling for a turtle. Uh, well, anyway, folks, that's a conclusion to this trip. But now we got to fix your trolling motor to store it. Yeah, that's going to be. But anyway, thanks again for watching. We really appreciate it. I wish I would have had more, more uh, video, but I dropped like at least 10 frames in the water. So anyway, thanks again. Fish more, catch more. And we'll see you on the flip side. Right, Jiggy? You know what I envision? I envision a lot of people going to this place, like a bar or something, and the name of the place is the flip side. And they're all waiting for you there. <laughs> yeah, I still don't know what the flip side means. <laughs> <laughs> I'll see you at the flip side. Well, where is he? He's standing online for Star Wars tickets. From the back seat, city going by as we're passing the streets. Dim lights in her basement, dark leather jacket in my whiskey means I can find a way to compromise and miss some looking in your eyes. And I know even all the rules behind. Welcome to the wild. It just goes to show that if you chum, they will come. Saw how many chummers that one, just that one snapper had in his belly. Baby, you don't know your power. I'll take you to the wild.